Welcome back to the channel. I am dressed in a hot dog for stream nonsensical reasons. I uh, will not be in it the whole time. I am very nervous to start playing this next chapter. Um, the last one ended very not so subtle. I was expecting more subtle death. It was very, a uh, very, he was a little rock to the face. Literal rock to the face. I'm nervous to get started again. We are in the stream doing a charity fundraiser, so you will see some extra stuff on screen on YouTube. Um, there's nothing I can do about it. It's for a very good cause. Go check out Games for Love yourself. And yeah, let's get to it. For the sadness to come. I love this background though. The paint. Oh, gorgeous. Lanterns. I'm not big on speeches. I've always believed that the role of the bartender is to shut up and listen. And by that measure, Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. I never issued a speeding ticket huh, a memorial in a to bar. someone on a bicycle before until he came along. He cared so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. <laughs> he booked my band to play the lantern all the way from Seattle to pretty much right where I'm standing. I can recall 14 specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. Ah. <laughs> Do you have them all written down, Dougie? The first was two oh, years ago. So, long story short, instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. Gabe stood like three feet away, grinning like a doofus at us. I'm sure there were more people, but I only remember him. And then he said, I know, that's why the K is silent. Ducky, <laughs> sorry. Uh, then the fifth time... Oh, God, Tucky. He cared about everyone. He was the kind of guy you wanted to be around. He was a world-class bullshitter. He was my best friend. say about Gabe is he came into this bar as a stranger but he left it as family <clears throat> guess that's that then what happened to Gabe was a senseless, tragic accident. And I just wish it that- It wasn't an accident. Son, now is not the time. Gabe called the mine. I gave him my sat phone to be sure he could get through. They fucked up. And now, now Gabe's dead. That was my shift. Bro. If anyone had called, it would have gone through me. 
Nobody called. Bro. You're lying. <laughs> In front of Gabe's own fucking sister. Alex heard the whole thing. Well, I didn't... I didn't hear Gabe make the call. But he told us he got through. Well, if Gabe said something, then I'm inclined to believe him, Mac. What are you saying? I'm not saying anything. Just, I didn't get a call. Try your own Bold conclusions. of him to even bring that up. All right, honestly. folks. This is an ongoing investigation. How about that we review the sequence of events, hmm? Well, son. When I saw you at the record store, you seemed pretty eager to find Gabe. Remember why? Hmm? Another fight with Riley, maybe? No, I don't have to take this. Just saying, pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Right. And just a couple hours later, you just so happened to miss the call that would have saved his life? Look, I told you there was no call to miss. Okay, maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit, I mean, it's not like, it's not like Gabe was Mr. Reliable all the time. You watch your mouth, Mac. Right, that's enough. Now, I'm just as eager as you to understand all this, son, but there was a time... Bullshit, and... Dad. This little weasel's calling Gabe a liar at his own fucking wake. No, I am just telling you. Mac, I swear, if you say there was no call one more fucking time... Stop it! Stop it now! This is not the time or place. <laughs> yes, Mac. We're all here for Gabe. Okay, Ryan? Sure, I'm... I'm sorry. It's not... I'm just... I'm not the one who killed him. <laughs> Aren't you, though? What the fuck did you just say? Ryan, back off. Oh, I'm hell. just saying. I thought I heard that you Mac, were the one. You shut the hell up. No. No, go ahead. You got something to say, Mac? Let's fucking hear Come it. On, guys. Let's go, Toe Don't face. make me interview. All right. Fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. Well, yeah, that's true. But it was to save Alex's life. I mean, anyone could see that. Blah! Why not that's you? That's it. Wait's over. Everyone out. Alex? Hey. Fuck those guys. Yeah. Are you okay? Not really. But I... I will be. Alex is... Erica, it's uh, not your job to keep it together. Familiar. She found, sounds like someone else. I can't place Thanks. it. Thanks. Do you... Um... It's messy, but... Do you want to come in? Sure. You play guitar? Yeah, well, sort of. I used to. Cool. I don't understand why there's such awkward long pauses sometimes between things. They like feel misplaced. 
I'm like, why is Gabe this would try to pop so wheelies long? outside the record store to make me laugh. Never worked. Till he wiped out. That was hilarious. I'm not talking about the pauses that make sense. Gabe really wanted to do the LARP for Ethan. But by the end of it, he was more jazzed about it than anybody. Wish I could have seen it. We took this a year ago. We... No way. I can't. What? We actually kept it. Whatever that bottle made her think of, it really messed her up. I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan. I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. You can turn the game down. I wonder how she's really holding up. find out what's really going on with Steph. What are they called again? Don't shit on my yard! They're amazing! Their guitarist has one arm! Badass. Don't shit on my yard. <laughs> Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait. Hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You just lost 50 bucks. La 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 la. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. Can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. I know the bands all have really funny names. Steph? Sorry. This is so embarrassing. I just need some time. I don't understand okay. why Steph's coming in to my space with her trauma. <laughs> It doesn't really seem very, it's a little selfish, a little selfish happening right now. I'm mourning too, just lost my brother. I need to- Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I move to Denver next week. You what?
what am I missing? Oh, we got a leak. We got a leaky floor over here. Her sadness is so strong. I hope I can help. Oh, here we go. Damn it, fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aw, <laughs> is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. Then I'll be crashing here tonight. I think I know enough to help her now. Mm, I don't. Go for it, Alex. Still can't believe he's gone. Yeah. He's the whole reason I'm still... I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. I kind of have to. You're, like, in my house. Making me comfort you over my dead brother. But hey. I could put on a record, if you like. Nah, not really in the mood. Maybe something else? Can I get you a drink or anything? No, thanks. I appreciate the offer, though. Sure. That wasn't right. How about a quick match? I'm gonna come up play? the stairs and comfort you and then cry in the corner. Yeah. <laughs> Rip. I just had a hunch. Oh! Yeah? Hot dog well, time is over. Right. I don't really think it's a great time. Well, I don't think it's a great time for you to be in my house crying. But here you are. Fine. First to five points. Is Alex in denial? Maybe so. she's in denial. She's feeling everyone else's emotions. She hasn't had enough time to feel her own. <gasps> we actually get to play foosball! So, how often did you and Gabe play? It was one of our favorite games. You must be pretty good then. Mm-hmm. Can I not move it up and down? You were in a band, right? Yeah. What'd you play? Drums. I am excellent at foosball. How, uh, how long did you play with them? Bye. Mm, too long. Gotcha. Oh, it just kind of moves those ones on their own. Oh, F. Ah! I didn't realize I could be doing F. So it! So it, Steph! Pwn in your ass! Mm, mm, mm. Five to zero! Five points! That's game! I probably yep. Big shocker. Probably should have let her win, huh? You played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No. I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. It requires skill, timing, and the will to be a champion. Oh, is that how it is? Okay, okay. Joking aside, playing this stupid game with you is exactly what I need right now. You're on. I'm actually trying this time, so you better focus. I am focusing. Good. Wouldn't want you to get distracted or anything. Certainly not. Uh 
Uh-huh. Greatest Northwest band of all time. Go. <laughs> Are you trying to distract me? Oh, of course not. <laughs> oh! My first... Slater Kinney, if you were wondering. serious one more game winner takes title of ultimate foosball champion mm, it's not know. like donkey Come kong on. you know gabe would be all about us playing like this well then it's settled <laughs> this is it for all the marbles so many marbles definitely the kind of game you want to focus on no matter what happens So are you into girls or what? <laughs> yeah. Girls are pretty rad, right? Especially girls that play foosball and host radio stations and wear beanies like it's a religion. <laughs> Sounds like a winning combo. Who's what? Exactly. Old enough to know better. Mode activated. Thanks, Alex. I'm really glad you talked me into it. It was a lot of fun. Of course. I meant to say both to her, but I was wanted to focus on my foosball. So, what are you gonna do now? What do you mean? That shit with Mac. He's clearly lying, right? I'm not sure what Mac's deal is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. For myself and for Gabe. Activate super sleuth mode! No matter oh, what. My glasses. Thank you. My glasses. That I can't means a see lot. without my glasses. It's like something's missing. I should head back to work. Cool. Bye. I flirted with her too hard on Bye. accident. I want to romance Ryan this this game because when we go through it again and chat helps me choose i know y'all are gonna choose steph so i want to know what happens when you romance ryan i know gabe made that call 
But did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? I just want to see what happens. I know y'all are going to pick Steph the second time we do it. So, like, why? Why aren't you letting me explore all options? Don't make me play the mind game again. Alex, I'm having a small event for your brother tomorrow at 9. I'd love to have you there. No pressure. You take all the time you need. Is that what we just did? Let me need you any groceries. I'll cover the Thanks, cost. Jed. Lot apartments yours as long as you need. Oh, that's very sweet. That's sweet. Do the notes have any... TV Dana. Living off these is not great, but it's so long, depression food. That action's gonna have consequences? Cleaning up? What? Do the dishes, do the dishes. to start. Clean the puzzle. Oh. One of the happiest memories I have. Thanks, Gabe. At least I got to have a few good moments. Um, okay, what am I supposed to do? Hey, Shushu. Thanks for sticking around. Get dressed. Woof Brothers! Ooh, that's cool. I want that sweatshirt. <gasps> Kitty Cat! Ah, oh, Squad! That's so cute! I just really like this outfit, all right? Gabe was the most, I forgot about all these. Gabe was the most caring person I've ever met. He never stopped looking for ways to make life better, whether that meant coming to the Haven to find his dad. That's why he came to Haven. Or fighting to get a grill all the way up the stairs to his rooftop. And he was always willing to help anyone else who wanted to improve their lives. He probably put even more hours into my college interview than I did. He was the kind of person you meet once in a lifetime. Goodbye, Gabe. I'll miss you forever. I'm here if you want to talk. All the boys. You're single now, right? I'm here if you want to talk. Send off. Bring something that reminds you of him. Regular hours, check website for details. Sorry for inconvenience. The Gunston County Sheriff Department's working hard to serve and protect the citizens. If you have any questions, concerns, well, uh, trails are closed as part of an active investigation. Can we just put this to bed? He was where he shouldn't have been. Someone's eager to give Typhon a pass. A person died. Doesn't that mean anything to people? This poster is available. Replies. No hot water. In all the darkness that surrounds the death of a loved one, I think it's important to remember the good times, so I want to share one of my favorite memories. I just sold him a bouquet. He admitted that he'd put his foot in his mouth again with his girlfriend and needed to make it up to her. I sent him on his way with some lovely tulips, but 15 minutes later... 
he was, there he was again. I asked Charlotte if I could have her two lips in exchange for these two lips. So now I'm back. Oh, that's really funny, though. I feel sick. We here at Typhon Mining were shocked and saddened to hear about Gabe Chen's death. Such a loss of life is always tragic and affects many in our community. We would like to take this time to assure the community that Typhon remains committed, as always, to following the strictest safety practices in the industry. Your community is our community. We will cooperate with any law enforcement investigations until this can be laid to rest. Blurp. Oh my god, so many text messages. Morning, Alex. Did you get my notes? I am so sorry. Let me know if I could do anything. Mm -hmm. I'm so sorry. Love Gabe can only imagine what you're going through. Please call me if you need anything. I'm so sorry. I should have saved him. I don't know what to say. Alex, I'm so sorry. You don't have to respond, but I just wanted to tell you. Thank you for saving Ethan's life. I don't know what I would do if I lost him. Thank you. Uh, well, he, yeah, um, let's check in with Ethan, who is entirely responsible for Gabe's death. <laughs> Ethan, fear. It's so easy for your brain to turn on you, the same part of you that tells stories and makes art and gives the world order and beauty and meaning is the part where nightmares grow, and sometimes those nightmares leak out, seep into the world around you. I can still see Ethan collapsing in on himself at the edge of the ravine. So scared that he couldn't move, couldn't breathe. I reached out because I had to reach out. I submitted to his fear because I couldn't think of any other way forward. And it worked. Um, we made it back and I collapsed on the hard, solid ground. And I kept thinking, this is who you can be if you want to be someone who keeps help, who helps people, someone who understands. For a few seconds, everything was so clear. But then the ground wasn't solid and Gabe was gone. What good am I to anyone if I stopped? Uh, I wasn't done reading my journal. None of it will save me. Ninth Warden wouldn't be afraid. I thought I could hunt the monster. Thought I could hunt it. Thought I could be brave. Nothing can save you. There's nothing to save. Thank you. Welcome. Steph. Sorrow. Steph's sadness was born out of love. It wasn't empty. There was dimension to it. A form and volume of loss that I could step inside. In there I met a Gabe who felt much like my own, only more so. An instigator, a listener, a prodder, a cheerleader, a shit stirrer. A brother, basically. It wasn't long, but it was enough to know exactly what Steph needed. The best piece of my brother I could conjure for her from thin air for just a moment. So I kicked her ass in foosball and celebrated in the worst obnoxious way I could, naturally. It was dumb and goofy and over in a flash, but in its wake, the sadness was lifted and Gabe didn't seem quite as gone as before. First, Ethan, now Steph, I think I'm finally starting to understand this thing. Gabe was right. It's a gift to connect to someone, to feel what they are feeling, to help them. Just wish he'd been around to tell me earlier. Foosball champion, don't shit on my yard. I'll be crashing here tonight. Move to Denver. One more game. I want to make things right, so I'll be crashing here tonight. Don't turn out the lights. Um, I don't care what you say. Daniel is the reason Esteban is dead. Ethan is the reason Gabe is dead. You can't change my mind. These, these 10 year oldish boys need to get their shit together because they're killing their parents. They're killing people. <laughs> they're killing their parents. See? I can be a person. Clean home, clean mind. Right, Dr. Lin? Clean home, clean mind. Does this count as me crying? No, I'm not even crying. My nose is running. Wait, can I can go upstairs now? <gasps> go upstairs. Oh, that's the rooftop. Go 
bridges. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. All we are is just in the wind. I'll toss those soon. I swear. Make them an art piece. No birds today. <sighs> Gabe really loved this place. Everyone really loves Colorado. Gabe was such a dad. They all have a flag. You could stay here too. I wouldn't try to stop you. Yeah, good. I'll be the only trans person in a town with a population of like four. That sounds like a blast for me. Thanks for not trying to stop me. I'm sorry, Izzy. It's not you. And it's not the band. I fucking love that shit. But I need to try this. It's just time for something new. I knew it. I knew this would happen eventually. Fucking see you around, Steph. Yikes! Um, can we talk about all these beautiful flowers? I would love a trough garden like this. Can I play golf? I bet Gabe could even make golf fun. Why look up at the sky when you could look at a sculpture instead? A shot of beans, oh my god. Torture. Let me make sure the soft giving alerts. I, they should be. Yeah, they're here. Okay, I don't know why I didn't hear them before. I like her shoes. She cute. Would have been fun to see Gabe crush some sweet powder. Or do a cake flip, dude. Snowboarders say. I'm pretty sure he cleaned up everything. I, uh... Feels like a million years since that day with Gabe. The kind of person who got that worked up over a college essay could be Looked capable of almost anything. Tray flip, dude. rooftop like theirs is gorgeous. Do 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 This ice cream says it's Swedish. Anyone in chat Swedish? <laughs> Oh, cantaloupe? No one likes cantaloupe? Who brought cantaloupe to this thing? Come on, guys, try harder. It is Nyx. I appreciate what you're trying to do for me, Mr. Lucan, but I'm not staying long. And I don't take handouts. Just maybe don't cash that check like right now. 
Aww. No one could blame me for wanting to drink all my sorrows away. Truth. I think Gabe had more fun at his job than anyone. Oh, ducky. Should we play? This looks weird. I also love Ducky. Oh, DMC. Oh, we didn't get to look at the skull before. Jet definitely has a decorating style. I'd call it steakhouse chic. That's a good R -M and TB. I wonder who they were. Ooh, donuts. Cheese plate. Deviled eggs. Good spread, except for the cantaloupe. Oh, hey, kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. wanted to apologize for all of us we're all grieving but that's no excuse it was your brother's wake and you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble i appreciate it i it was pretty rough want to be as cute as alex chen although it's hard to imagine i wish i looked like alex chen alex wake. chen no she's so cute there's no good version just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. I'm also gonna look for glasses like that because now I really want them. Wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I need to talk nose. to Matt. I want her nose. I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can find him? Hell, he helps out Eleanor at the flower shop. That'd be the place to start. Thanks. Yeah, but like, I want to look. I don't know. I, I just, I don't know like why. I, I want to be though. Alex. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for, if you get any at all. Just don't pin all your hopes on. She Matt has Loudon. puppy dog eyes. That's what it is. She has like puppy dog, literal like literal puppy eyes. She's got these cute brown puppy dog eyes. Thanks for looking out for me, but. What else am I supposed to do? I wish I had an answer for you. But if you get a chance before you go all dirty, Harry, swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. And one more thing. I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days, but I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door and the one upstairs. Thanks, Jed. This is your home now for as long as you'd like. See, when she looks up like that, whenever she like looks up at people, she's got those puppy dog eyes. What about rent? I don't want to be a freeloader. Don't worry about that for right now. We'll work out a way for you to earn your keep when the time comes. Weed is hell illegal in California, Colorado. Give them hell. Seattle. It's so weird that something that's like completely legal in one state is like can go to arrest in another state. I have no idea what to even say to him. A year ago, I was ready to ditch this place to keep moving like I always do. And a year ago, D Dave, Gabe was the reason I stayed. But even though he's gone now, and even though I miss him like hell, I still have reasons to stay. Thanks for showing me that, Alex. Even if you do cheat a foosball. Girl, please. I'm the champ fair and square. 
Mac has deleted their comment. Yeah, get out of here, Mac. You good, Jed? You good? Okay, Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop, but I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want. <clears throat> what did I not get to finish? On one hand, there's the open road and the freedom to run away from my problems. On the other, helmet hair. Helmet hair, poor angry people on their cell phones. I wonder how many fish Ducky's caught in this thing. Yeah, Ducky, show me your fish. Sitting on the dock of the bay. Do I even want to stay here without Gabe? In this state I've never been to before. This town I've been in for less than a week. Not that I know where else I'd even go. Back to the nothing waiting for me in Portland. Fuck. I have no idea what comes next. But I'm not leaving here without answers about Gabe. At least I know that. Angry people looking at their phones. What's over here? The park looks fun to explore. Oh, oh, I can explore? If not for the paddling, kayaking would be super relaxing. Kayaking is so hard. God, be fair I haven't been a bartender long, but I'm pretty sure these are supposed to stay in the bar. It's a wolf sculpture. This is cool. In a wicker man sort of way. A tree sculpted out of a tree? I don't tree? think this oh, whole no, town a is a pagan cult, but I can't rule it out either. I mean, that would be pretty cool. Yeah. Everyone needs to stop telling me it's okay. It's not. Fuck. Hey, buddy. Hey, Alex. Do you want to talk about it? I'm fine. I'm not going to push him. OK, definitely not fine. Ew! Is it Green Man or is it Ducky? At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if the Spring Festival ends with a ritual sacrifice. Newspaper guy. This is awful. He was so young. He must be reading about Gabe. He was so young. Kayaking is exhausting, yeah. It's hard work, kayaking. I'm exploring. Duh! Disc golf! What if I'm secretly a total prodigy at disc golf? But never had the chance to find out. Now's Probably your chance. For the best, honestly. Oh, all right. Work 
power. Kate was too young. Just too young. Too young. Hey, Pike. Hey. Um, how you holding up? Guess I've been better. Yeah, right. Dumb question. Hey, I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Gabe was something else. He could bring a smile to my face even on the worst days. Yeah, that's what everyone's been saying. And, uh, when you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. I think I'll be ready soon. Yeah. I want her haircut. Yeah. I love her haircut. No rush. It's real cute. Wildflowers. Insert epiphany about new beginnings here. Nice to know. Hipsters can survive at this altitude. Haha. <clears throat> Ski and bike. Treasures of Tibet. Oh, is that the flag people are mad about? A Tibetan chime? Wind chimes. The original jam band. One doctor had me try meditation. I always just fell asleep. That makes me, I mean, yeah. Fall asleep. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Oh, that's right. I didn't check my... Um... People texted me. Um, okay. Do I still go dry again? Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said, Why should one accident close all the trails? What a wasted vacation. Yes. We're wow. all suffering here. Shut your hole. Hey. I think the hey. Can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. That's rough. She's like, why are you standing right next to me? If I tell him I like him, we'll date, and then we'll break up, and then I'll lose my best friend. Awkward. It might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Pretty mural. Guess they didn't feel like painting the mine. Okay, let's check out the dispensary. Let's go to the dispensary together, chat! Oh, this sorry. is a big moment! We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? Thanks, Diane. Um, yeah. Way to bring him up. Don't touch me. I, I don't didn't know, know you. him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. You don't need to be I'm so me. sorry for your loss. All right, chat. This is a big moment. Everybody get take get a buddy. We're going into the dispensary together. It's legal. We're not doing anything illegal. Unlike the last game when we trimmed weed. I guess that wasn't illegal either. Well, it was illegal for Daniel to be doing it. Cracks me up that she wants a dispensary. Alex. Hey. Oh, Jeff, look at the you alien bomb! Hilarious. I just wanted to see how you were doing. 
I've been trying to stay busy mostly. Yeah. Distractions help. You do not like your belt, Charlotte. How about Sorry. you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. It's his fault. He does seem distant. He practically just lost a father. But he's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. He's a pretty insightful kid. He knows how much you're hurting, even when you try to hide it from him. Instead of trying to be strong, maybe the best thing you can do is show him that it's okay to hurt. Quality advice from my girl, Alex. That's really helpful, Alex. Thank you. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death is Gabe. Irony. What is this? An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. A big one. I would hope so. How big are we talking? It's send Ethan to college big. Shit. Are you gonna sign it? I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but... What would you do? Do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? Ooh. 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 I want an option that's like, can you wait until I find out who's responsible for his death? <laughs> Where's that option? I want an option for that. Also, but like, she runs a weed store in a tourist town. She's got to make decent money. And Ethan's really smart. He can probably get a scholarship. gonna be like one of the, the people in the towns' fault. So if um so if you it would like I don't know if she'd ever need to press charges against them. Like we're probably looking at putting Mac in jail or something. Oh no! I didn't mean to you choose to that one! I didn't mean to choose that one! This is, that was not what I wanted to choose! <laughs> it went like blah blah blah! And I Click the wrong one. Trail of 
okay. There we I don't go. think you should sign it. I'm sorry. I know it's hard, but you can't let Typhon buy you off. Gabe made that call, and I'm gonna prove it. I just. I really can't think of who time. else could possibly be responsible besides Mac. Thanks for being honest. But I guess the game also hasn't told us like who else works for Typhon or anything yet. If they're willing to pay Charlotte to keep quiet, they're definitely hiding something. I really appreciate you stopping by. Of course, she's right. But I could really use that money. We can't give in, no matter how hard it is. Look Last at that Gandalf so pose! Cool. They're like works of art that can also get you high. Yeah. I'm gonna figure out why Max lying. Probably cost more than my bus ticket. Da bang. Ooh, hookah. I miss hookah. And he did it all with one rusty saw and a bottle of gin. Impressive. Qualfeather Sanatorium operated successfully until its closing in 1927 under the guidance of Dr. Martin Kellogg. Over 500 influenza and tuberculosis patients were treated and cured. The rest who died refused to get vaccinated or wear masks. Oh, I'm sorry. Was that not there? Okay. Wonder what it's like to have I do my drugs out of a glass sculpture type of money. <laughs> That's funny. My old roommate had a hookah. It was fun. I could totally paint that. I just don't want to. <laughs> These are my kind of discounts. A little steep. But can <laughs> you really put a price on a kid's dreams? Ethan. Nice contribution, Gabe. <clears throat> God, put some clothes Mary on. Mary Jane, try this new growing trick for big voluptuous nugs. Which vape is right for you? Check out this buyer's guide. High and dry, how to tell if you're buying waterlogged weed. How long does THC really stay in your system? It blows my mind that Charlotte's been running the dispensary this whole time. I couldn't even leave the apartment. Somebody, as you may have heard, someone very close to me has recently passed away. The last few days have been very hard on me and Ethan. We're doing our best to keep our heads up. So many of you have reached out with kind words that has meant the world. I cannot thank you enough for your support. I'll try to open the store for a few hours every afternoon, but things will probably be a little sporadic for the next few weeks. Sorry for any inconvenience and thank you in advance for your patience. Your friendly neighborhood bud tender. Amber would like this game. Oh yeah, let's take a look at the strain when list. When did you start needing a PhD to smoke pot? Get a sativa to indica to hybrids. Intergalactic. Stairway ride. to Haven. That's a Zemi. In the Dominican, they're said to house the spirits of gods. Mostly, I just like how it looks. It's really- There's something you don't see in Portland. I really love Charlotte's style. I do too. T-shirts. Sweet logo. Bet Charlotte designed it herself. Ooh, going back with the weed. These bougie dispensaries are going to put all the creepy dudes named Jean out of business. That's really funny. Man, these things better do the trick. I'm averaging like three hours a night. Pro tip, insomnia doesn't usually come from nowhere. And THC is way better at treating it when you're also tackling the underlying cause. Hmm. Any idea what's keeping you up? Someone perhaps wishing you dead? Charlotte's office slash studio? Charlotte's dedication to her art is so inspiring. 
Marijuana tea? There's nothing quite like a cup of weed on a cold day. Cup of weed. Cup of weed, cup of weed. Get a shag, cup of weed. And which part of the brain is responsible for the crazy glowy feelies? Crazy glowy feelies. Didn't she say I could have something? Of course, she's right. But I could really use that money. Can't talk to you anymore, okay. Well, we've thoroughly explored the dispensary. Um, I would want Daniel's power. It seems like the most emotionally, the least emotionally traumatic. Now, Daniel's life was emotionally traumatic, but not because of his power. It just triggered his power. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Yeah, 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 we will. It's fine. I love being on hold. I love this song. Yikes. Raw. I have a lunch ice cream. I don't get it. Do people ice cream just... man. I have to keep up a brave face for Angela. She loves our store so much. He must ice be exhausted. Cream woman. We're losing our business. But it's like everything's a joke to him. She must feel so alone. Hope they figure it out. Nothing says festive like three exclamation points. Steph asked three me to Three exclamation points. Time. Three exclamation points. My inside voice screams a lot. It's fine. Look at the kitty Steph ninja. Asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. Helpful. Uh, who owns the store? It's not Steph. Gabe was hoping I'd get back into playing. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Looks like Steph might be working on a new project. Oh, here it is. Is it Daniel? Or whatever his name is from First Life is Strange? Time to pay a visit to an old friend. Or should I say, an old enemy. You don't belong here, Monster Slayer. I'm not leaving here till I get answers. You won't be leaving at all. Yeah, yeah, no. Where is the Sky Sword? Fine, I'll tell you. The sword was last seen in the city of Carneris. Carneris, but it's infested with were spiders. All who quest for that sword lose something dear to them. But I'm destined to save the realm with the Sky Sword. Good thing you won't be questioning alone. Questing alone. I'll win! Is it him? No. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. It's hard to beat breakup music. Just a sad But thing. maybe I can find something around here to cheer him up. You, you want to cheer up this guy? Why are you cheering up everyone except yourself? You've got to, you've got to focus on yourself, girl. You got to focus on yourself, girl. I hope we all get to see more adventures of Thanor. Happy song for him?
Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you talked to Ethan at all? Talked is maybe too strong a word. I tried. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like the one you and Gabe were gonna take him to? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. Can we even pull that off? It won't be high production value, but it'll still be fun. Hey! I need your help though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? Yeah, I've got one. So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Gravius, Lord of the Underworld, Storm Rider the Undead. Storm Rider looks like a worthy opponent. He gets my vote. <laughs> All right, then. Oh, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. Be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Hey, can you do my job for me? <laughs> Oh man, these hey, characters. Hey, listeners, that was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. We've got a sweet block of indie rock coming down the pike, but first. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. She wants me to play a bard. Alex, fill in your character! Yes! The bard. Half elf bard, distortion field, or healing serenade. How did you meet Thanor? Guess I'm in. Let's start Let's with my do it. name. Let's do it. Barb. The mission is free this year, so bring your friends, bring your family. Hell, bring your. Ex. How about a throwback to Ethan's old buddy? Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Healing Serenade! Let's do it! I just played D&D &D last night! It is. I got a <gasps> How did I meet Thanor? You guys. Last night in D&D, &D, I got a riding dog. My three foot tiefling bard has a dog that she rides on. That is all. Thank you for coming to my TED talk. A wolf and an ogre walk into a bar. Uh, oh god. <laughs> this LARP thing just might work. I thought I was actually gonna have to make calls. I was like, no. I have things to do. I have to confront Ethan. Val, I just wanna be friends. Oh, I named the dog Thunderwave after my favorite spell that I cast often at the worst times. <laughs> often almost killing me and all my my companions. I'm calling TW for short. It's a giant fluffy mastiff like dog. I had to buy a saddle and everything. <laughs> and harder. It's surprisingly no, addictive. Cast the spell. You have still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Shocking. Mm, who's texting me? Of course Ethan's gonna love it. It's nerd shit. Ethan loves er, nerd shit. Okay, flower store, flower store, flower stores over here? No, flower stores over here. Bench girl! Oh, it's that guy's sister. I feel so bad for her. Getting sick of people feeling Ugh. bad for me. Literally standing over her. <laughs> oh, 
Why am I getting? I'm like just have like footstep noises in my ear. Look at all the model grannies on the wall. Oh, model grannies, model grannies. Hello. Hello. Oh. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> no need to apologize. How are you, dear? Oh. I'm, um... Still just trying to adjust, I think. Give yourself some time. Change is always hard. Uh, is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> she just Thanks. giggled like a little girl. Now, what was I? Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh, she's getting dementia, maybe? She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. Ma'am? Why won't it let me to go around? That must have been a different time. What? Give me the thing! Dang you. There we go. Why won't it let me? Okay. Riley is officially a badass. Nice. I've definitely lived in uglier places. It's pretty pretty. I am holding the rice, the rice, the right button down. It's just not appearing. They look like they have a really sweet relationship. Everyone wants an orchid until they realize how much work it takes to keep them alive. Word. Kind of like Foster Gabe never did teach me how to ride a bike. Aww. I'm holding it down and it's failing to appear. It's pissing me off! Hello! I would like to help the confused old lady! Please, for the love of biscuits. Oh, don't do it. Oh, don't do it. Okay. Time to figure out why she's afraid. All my memories, All my memories are, fading. are fading. I feel, I feel broken. broken. Wow. Wow. Okay. What else? What else you got for us, Eleanor? Thank you, dear. I'll get started on it right away. Just come by with the check whenever you're free. Yeesh, kabibbles. If Riley, if Riley finds, finds out, out, she can't, she can't find, out. find out. Cause she would stay and Eleanor doesn't want her to stay. Okay. All right, let's go. How does she hide all of this? Okay, I have not found everything. Oh, here we go. The doctor said the doctor I had, said more, I time, had more time, but everything, everything is becoming is so, so out, of, out order. of order. Oh, it's so sad, it's so sad. Can I talk to her now? No. Mortified. Mortified. Oh. 
the sign. If they know if they about know my condition, my they'll make me close this place. She forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting. Forget what you were working on? <sighs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, maybe I can help. Um. You could focus on something else for a bit and see if it comes back. I suppose. But I can't help feeling like it was something important. Whatever it was. Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your steps. Oh, I don't want to keep you. <sighs> oh my gosh, you can see... Oh my gosh, you could see the checkered floor Please. reflecting in her glasses. That was I, cool. Top tier. Help. Top tier. Okay. What would Eleanor have done first? Did you trim these flowers today? I don't remember. I mean, they've got something written on them. You must have flipped the sign to open. I always flip it first thing when I come in. And then I open my mail. <sighs> something must have distracted me. We can do this. We can do this! Where where was the showing the mail? You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. You don't have to do this. I'll be all right on my own. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. Lady, let me help. Um, I wish I knew where it was showing the mail. Then did you trim these? Did you trim these flowers today? I... All right, so maybe Don't the phone remember. rang. Did the phone ring? You got distracted. The phone rang. Could a phone call have distracted you? Flower Lady 44. Yes. I got a call first thing in the morning. But I can't think who it was. Ooh, the clock. Maybe we can find something to remind you. What would have reminded you? Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. Goodness. What was the order for? You should write it down, Mama! Write it down, Nana! 
have to write shit down? <laughs> okay. You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. I would have done that last night. Oh, okay. Um... Now these? There's a note on them. Rush order. This must be what Riley came in for. I think that order might have been for these lilies. We have a cold dog statue in the back. Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. Okay. I think the register is the only place left to go. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. Should. Kerching! Mr. Jedediah Lucan. Huh. Jedediah! Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. Nana. I couldn't have done it without you. Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. Ma'am. God. She doesn't remember. Awkward! Um, just tell her. They were... They were for Gabe's wake. Gabe's wake? Gabe's wake? I... Missed it. Poor Nana. Alex. I'm... I'm so sorry. Hey, it's um... Excuse me. <laughs> okay. That sucked. But at least I told her the She's truth. She's gonna fight out again eventually. Uh, that poor young man. How did I forget? Poor I'm young so man. Eleanor. Oh God, they're multiplying. Ha! <laughs> Multiply gnomes! What do you want? You want to make fun of me too, like those other jock assholes? What? No. I, you made a sick killer robot in one fucking contest. That's. First of all, we got third place, and anyway. He's not a robot. Technically, he's... Ugh. God. Way to take the bait, Rai. You know what? Fuck those pricks. You rule. And I would really like to see your robot. Ooh, he wants to see her if robot. Mac was nice once. Once. Great things have small beginnings. Or something. He did just, she did just say it wasn't a robot, but Mac is a toe with the brain of a toe. Therefore, he still called it a robot. Eleanor said Mac is nearby. 
Hmm, I wonder what Steph's working on. I already saw that. What do I miss? Oh, mm, no. What's... Oh, Jasmine Cormier. Has anyone good advice taming stray cats? Found this cutie in my trash can. That's a, f that's a mountain lion, ma'am. Jasmine, that's not really stray. That's a mountain lion cub. Be very careful. <laughs> they can be very aggressive and threatened. Try leaving a door, but it may leave on an, its own. And if he's under my bed, broom, I'm calling animal control. <laughs> stray cat. Straight up mountain lion. Good lord. These people. I don't see him here. Maybe at the bridge? Where to? That'll help. Please say it's not the one you read to me the other day. That was so weird. It's not weird, it's fun. Uh, what bridge? <laughs> what bridge are we talking about? Man, these overnight shifts really take it out of me. Yeah, my sleep schedule's fucked. Coffee in the morning? Do, 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 do. Is there a bridge over here? I went over here. That's where newspaper guy is. This is the dock. Oh, sorry. Bear the watcher. You're fine. Oh, I ran into a lady. My bad! Fishing boat, mining tours, mining cart. Okay. This is probably the most haven thing I've seen yet. I love it. Can I go down this way? Yes, I can. Tragically, now isn't the time to check out the rest of Haven. Boo! Boo! Is there a map? I haven't seen a bridge. I've seen this one street. Oh, it was when I came in. This location gets all the foot traffic. Oh, customers here are a lot nicer than in Denver. Never been to Denver, but I guarantee they're nice here. Running, running, and running, running, and running, running. Newspapers. I have to imagine Gabe would be amused to know he made it in the newspaper. Blah! I'm in Haven, and now I can never get out. How's your progress in Moondrop Ranch? Did you buy Ooh, your chicken coop? Moondrop Ranch, let's go! Sounds like some Stardew Valley. Hey, you piece of toe. I'm so fucked. Can't yeah, hide you are. from me forever, Mac. Boo! Mac. Alex. Look, it's not a good time. You what is owe it? me an explanation about what happened to Gabe. What? Costing me my girlfriend wasn't enough for you? Now you're gonna accuse me of killing Gabe, too? Yeah. I get it. He died on your shift, and you're freaked. But you have to come clean. Please. There's nothing I can tell you. I'm Mac, surprised he admitted it on. at all, honestly, to them. He was my big brother. I watched him get hit in the I face can't. by a rock. And almost dragged me down with Something him. definitely has him scared. Maybe if I could tap into his fear, I could get to the truth. I just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. Let's mess up Max's life. What can I do to piss him off? Everyone's out to get me. Alex, Ryan, even Riley. Ooh, let's try oh, up Riley. Even Riley? Did something? We're done here. Everyone's 
Ryan's out to get me. Alex, Ryan. So should I go to Riley? Even Riley. Fuck. Maybe I should go see Riley then? But if she's not working in the store, where? Talk to Riley, yeah, okay. Where does she work again? I thought she worked in the flower shop. Where is she when she's not in the flower shop? Can I ask her aunt? Her nana? Grandma. Okay, that sucked. But at least I told her that. I hope it's good news. I don't think it is. All right. Um, heck, where would I find Riley? I don't think there's a candy shop in here. I didn't want to see if maybe Riley was magically in, working at the flower shop now. She wasn't in the record store, and she wasn't in the record. I just uh, need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. The weed shop. Have you? Uh, no. Where else can't? Where else can I go in? Uh, wait. Can I go in the drug store? Can't go in the mining museum. Maybe in the bar? Perhaps. Perhaps she's at the bar. Nah, not yet. No hints yet. Not sure when the words Gabe Chen and Wake will stop being weird. But now, isn't it? Riley, are you in here? No. Wait. No, that's a donut box. I thought that was like a pink jacket. Uh, I guess she's just hiding out in the... Somewhere in the... Wilderness? We're not anywhere near the ice cream store. Something I could use Stop to giving push me that over the dialogue. edge. Is this? Uh, the ice cream dialogue is glitched. <laughs> Sorry about leveling all your mountains. Here's a bench. Here's the bench. You're writing a novel? What if I die tomorrow? Just like that guy. What have I done with my life? I don't have any easy answers for that. Babe, this is great. Uh, uh. Riley! Oh, Riley! I feel like I've been all around the town and haven't seen her. I've been all around town.
Ooh, miner. Let's get in your head. Talk about the accident? How would I know that? Fuck, now I'm on Diane's shit list. Ooh, Thanks, Diane. Diane. That's right, she works for them. I couldn't go in the snow, it's closed. Can I go down this alley? I haven't gone down this alley. There we go. If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like what? Like Make a him. toe! Alex. Hey. Gotta run! <laughs> that fight Mac had with Gabe over your secret meetings. They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of him, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, I can see that they were right. Do you think he's telling the truth about the call? That Gabe never made it? No, I... I it's not that... I... Sorry. I'm really not ready to talk about it. Yeah, I get it. It's just, if he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has something to hide? Her hair looks pink right now. He asked me to leave Haven with him. What? Right after the wake. He wouldn't tell me why. But he just looked so guilty. I told him no. And that we were done. And now... I'm scared he did something horrible. Riley. Thank you for telling me. Everybody's gonna stop touching each other on the shoulders. You deserve no the one truth. wants to be touched on the shoulder. Just stop. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him so much. like an older brother to me. I'm glad he had you. Thank you, Alex. Really. You and Eleanor seem close. She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but she's always been there for me. What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. That's really sweet. She's the most selfless person I know. I know having you work with her in the shop has meant the world. Yeah. To both of us. I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. We'll talk soon. Hey, 
Eleanor's texting me. Oh, Eleanor has my number already. Did someone post my number on like a, a town forum? Yeah. Whenever you want. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. Let's go. Let's go. I should make sure there's nothing game. else I want I mean, to do before Mac. I confront Mac. I don't. I did everything. What Riley told me might do it, but I should make sure there isn't anything I still want to do around town first. Okay, let's do this. Your ex-girlfriend told me about your plans to skip town. That's not something innocent people do. Oh God, it's not. I didn't do anything. <gasps> Fuck off! <laughs> Leave me alone! Get him! Get him! Why is everyone staring at me? Oh, he feels like everyone's staring at him. Deal with Mac when I get to him. For now, I need to learn. Typhon's always watching. They run this whole town. Paranoia! May I, Mac, may I suggest you never smoke the weed in this town? Mac feels like everyone's staring at him. Everyone thinks I killed him. They all hate me. I mean, I'm gonna tell you. I'm pretty sure everyone hated you before Gabe died, but, you know, it's just... It's uh, not it's fair! Not I didn't do anything wrong! It should have been you instead! Alex? Alex, you're being a weirdo. Oh, creepy. No, what the hell? There are people out there. No, I told you to call it off. I saw the way they looked at me at the wake. They all think I let him die. I know why you're lying. Typhon's forcing you to deny the call. What the fuck? <sighs> yeah, this power is a lot. I know you tried to stop it. They fucked up, not you. Stop lying for them! You don't get it. This wasn't some accident. I told them you were down there, and they detonated anyway. On purpose? Why? I don't know. I swear. And then I get a message telling me to deny there was ever a call. You gotta believe me. Gabe and I... We didn't get along, but I, I didn't want him dead. And now, now Typhon's watching me. My girlfriend, she, she thinks I'm a murderer? My neighbors all hate me? I mean, what, 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 what the fuck? 
fuck am I supposed to do? Breathe. 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 I think I can calm him down, but does he deserve it? Yeah, he deserves it. All right, Mac. We just moved here. We're everyone's babysitter, but it's you gotta fine. You got calm down, okay? Dude, stay with me. I know what it's like to be doubted. To have everyone think the worst of you. But the truth will come out. I'll make sure of it. But Typhon... If Typhon comes after you, they're gonna have to get through me too, okay? Life. <laughs> so, what are you gonna do now? Don't leave Haven. I'm gonna get to the truth. Yeah, I'm glad we didn't take the money, the hush money. Screw you, Typhon! If you need to throw up, Alex, like, that's cool. That would make sense. Hey. Yeah, it's... Can we talk? Where are you? Okay. Hello, Bernie Sue. How are you? <laughs> Max and Alex would totally be friends. Totally, totally. I'm enjoying it. You know I enjoy a good Life of Strange game. Mm, especially when they do nature. It's beautiful. Good lord, Ryan. You were right. About Typhon, about Mac. Alex. Mac got the call. How do you know that? He got the call and he lied about it. Doesn't matter. Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet. Someone from the mine and... It doesn't matter! Oh man, Angie boy. I keep coming here. And playing it back. But it always ends the same. Ryan. He's dead. He's really dead, Alex. Everyone's emotional babysitter. Um, I need to check, oh, whoops, something real quick in my emails. Um, okay, cool. I need to know what Ryan is feeling. So much anger, he angry boy. Oh, 
The burden of being a protagonist, sorting out everyone else's shit. It was my fault. My job is to keep people safe. And I failed. Ryan. I owe you my life. She's wrong. I let her cross that log. I put Gabe in harm's way. I'm not a hero. I'm a coward. Worse than worthless. I want to find Ryan's voice actor and be his friend. He's good. I like Ryan. You've got to stop torturing yourself. You did everything you could have. It doesn't matter. Gabe's dead because of me. Gabe, mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm so sorry. forgive you. How could I not? You're not alone. So good at talking characters off of ledges, yo! I wonder why. That's the same way Kate falls into Mac. <laughs> whoa, whoa, hold on. <laughs> There's a guy in a gorilla suit? <laughs> Does he also jump off of the cliff and into the pool? No, no, he chases a guy in a banana suit. <laughs> that guy jumps off the cliff and into the pool. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. This is a Mexican restaurant? Eh, nominally. <laughs> <laughs> the food is, uh, well, terrible. But it's Gabe's favorite place. I tell you, he's the oldest 12 year old I know. Can I ask you something? Of course. You came up here to tell me that I was right about Mac. About him getting the call. How did you know? There's something you should know about me. And it's gonna be easier to show you than to explain How it. How can she show it? It's not like Daniel's power or Max's power. This is gonna seem sort of weird at first, then really weird. Do you trust me? Um, what do we want? I don't want anger. Okay. Think of something that just scares the shit out of you. Really focus until you feel it. Mac, Typhon, all of it. You're afraid you won't know how to handle it without Gabe. Never knew anyone so good at getting into and out of trouble. <laughs> oh, man, this one time. Yay, happiness! <laughs> feelings
Whatever it is you're thinking about right now, don't stop, okay? Keep going. Okay. <laughs> what emotion is this? Happiness! <laughs> Joy? <laughs> About time she got a good emotion. Must be a good memory. I wonder if I can piece it together. How deep you think? Deeper than that. The Royal Canadian Mounted Police can spot a goose grave at a hundred paces. <laughs> the Mounties? <laughs> oh, come on, man. Oh, I'm the cloud's sorry. a shovel. Okay. <laughs> I was how like, where is like a penis? And then I was like, oh, it's a shovel. I wasn't going to stop you. <laughs> I see it. It'll move. <laughs> it's not moving. <laughs> It'll move. Gabe! <laughs> a goose cloud. This one's a car. <laughs> or rather, hole in clouds making a oh, car. That's a lot of blood, huh? Gabe. This is serious. Killing a Canadian goose is a violation of international law. Shut up. It is not. They're Canadian geese, Gabe. Property of the crown. Property the, of the crown. The crown of... Property of the crown, Gabe. The crown, Gabe. What do we do? So, <laughs> did you finish burying the goose or not? <laughs> okay, also... Property of the crown? <laughs> really? <laughs> well, they are technically protected under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act. <laughs> <laughs> How? Property of the crown! I'm basically some kind of superhero. So... I guess I have this power. I can see other people's emotions. They show up like an aura, and if I get too close, I... I feel what they feel. As if I was feeling it myself. And when I focus, I can even understand why they're feeling it. And that's what you just did with... with me? Whew. His hair's too I'm blonde in this scene. <laughs> no kidding. It's... it's only ever been the bad emotions before. That, that was pure joy. Who else knows? Gabe did. But now I guess just you. And that's how I know Max terrified of Typhon. He reported Gabe's call, and they ignored it. Now they're putting pressure on him to toe the line. Okay, but... why? I don't know yet. 
someone made the decision to let the blast go off. Seems like finding out who would be a good start. So you're going after Typhon? Kind of. You'll need help. You don't have to. You're stuck with me now. He's got like Disney, like Disney Prince vibes. And I can't, I'm sorry, I'm falling for it. You're welcome, I guess. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. No. Thank you. Yeah, he's like Kristoff. I just want him to hug me. I just want to hug. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Oh, I hope no one can see that. I'm sorry. Uh, hold on. Don't look at chat. No one look at chat. Clear my chat. All right. This one's for you, Gabe. I miss you. I didn't speak this morning. I couldn't. Hearing everyone talk about him, about the life he had here with all of you, I lost the chance to have that. But even though I only had one day with him, he changed my life. I said, I didn't know if I belonged here. He told me that home isn't something you find. It's something you build.
Oh, no. Well, everyone's visiting Charlotte. That's nice. Um, I seem to be pretty much doing the... Oh, didn't add anything to the memory table. Whoops. <laughs> uh, didn't look at the dartboard. Oh, man. Boo. I didn't sit at the table. Well, whoops. Um... Ooh, Ryan accepted my forgiveness. Hey! Alex and Ryan and Alex shared a hug. Alex claimed the title of foosball. Hey! Alex didn't help the bird watcher. Oh, oops. I thought. Oh, it said something about helping the sad dude, but I couldn't figure out how. My bad. Um, calmed Mac down, reminded, didn't take the money. Oh, that was the beginning. Okay. Oh, that was a lot of sads. A lot of sad sads now. A lot of sad sads. Um, so, closing thoughts on this. Where are we at? Closing thoughts on this are... I wish it was, like, a little, like, I mean, I know that the point is to miss some things. I was really unclear when it was, like, help this sad guy. And then I was, like, did I even hear that? Um, I really like being able to help people with the memories. It's kind of, it kind of reminds me exactly of, I think that might be why people are liking this. It reminds me, it, although it's, like, a totally different power, it kind of works really similar to Max's power, because, like, Max would rewind to look for clues, and she just, like, goes into this emotional space and looks for clues, so it's very similar. Um, it, 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 it operates very similarly, which, which could be a, a chunk of why people are really liking it. Um, but it's also just good. It's also just good. Um, this game does fail on this action will move the game on notifying. Yes, yes. There have been a couple times where I've been like, no, I didn't realize that would end it. Um, it did it with Mac. It was like, are you sure you're done? Um, but I had already done everything. Um, I like being able to walk around the town. That's really cool. I'm glad we calmed down Mac. He looked like he was about to do something desperate. Didn't love that. If you were watching this on YouTube, thank you for watching. Please feel free to like and subscribe. Uh, check out my other Life is Strange videos or other video game playthroughs, etc. And I hope you come back for chapter three. Let me know in the comments what you think of Mac. If, if you think he deserves more sympathy or not. If he's on like an, a Nathan Elliott level. I think he's a little more sympathetic than them. Just tell me how you feel about the characters. And I'll see you next time. Thank <laughs> you.